I'm just getting ready to go back down, but uh, this is the uh, the aluminum type piping that goes up to a roof jack way down there where the other exhaust fan is for the bathroom. This one happens to go to the uh, the um, laundry room and and that kind of stuff. But that's how they vent that, and that's a good way to do it. And I I had to crawl all the way back there because years ago they used to have uh, exhaust uh, fans, you know, for the bathroom. Uh, you either had it hooked up to a three inch uh, in diameter aluminum duct work like this or four inch and it sure looked like four and I thought I'm not taking any chances because uh, if I do happen to go to the store and get a new exhaust fan light combo I wanted to make sure it, that it had the right extension on the end I don't I didn't want to go to the store maybe maybe nowadays they only make them in four inch I don't know but I thought I better check it anyways okay and so now whoo I'm still catching my breath thanking my lucky stars and I'm still okay my knees still not out of whack and, and you just have to, you just have to be careful when you're walking around I, I hit my head over there because I was trying to go fast and, and uh, get ready for you to show you over there but you just have to be careful I got a hat on my glasses on uh, my protective glasses on a dust mask on my gloves on a back support brace on a knee brace on long sleeve shirt on all that kind of stuff when you're working up here and take your time don't think you're gonna just do this in, a, in an hour or two okay it just never works that way and be careful with this thing you, you know even if I set that down hard or kind of fast and just kind of drop it and stuff that light could burn out so I'm very careful with that um, when I'm carrying it around and another thing is you always you always want to turn it on and off with this button um, I, I did it one time and, and I just left the button on and and, and uh, I unplugged the extension cord at the end of the day and the next day um, wherever I was I just plugged the ex extension cord back in and it blew the, and it blew the bulb it blew the bulb in here Okay, so just that. And the bulb wasn't even that old. Alright, so uh, just be careful when you when you work around these construction lights. And, and the other thing too is when you replace the bulb, you don't want to get your uh, your fingers on there. They have a little, a little uh, styrofoam thing around the bulb and you just need to be real, real careful because you don't, just your finger marks will put oil on uh, the bulb. And then when the bulb heats up, it could... It, it's liable to burn out because I had one burn out um, and it and the and the um, the construction light was only oh I don't know three months old and that could have had something to play with it too okay and always make sure you get extra bulbs that you can buy them in uh, two packs three packs singles at the store and I did that or I went back to the store after I got this one and I did get some extra bulbs but I left them at home when I brought all my tools to Auntie's house, okay? So important things to remember when you're working up in the attic and when you're working with the construction light. All right, I'm gonna head back down to the bathroom and check the fan out a little bit closer. Hey, one last thing. When you're up here in the attic, you know, spread all of your you're blowing insulation back okay spread it all out and I did that I got back down in there undid the plywood from the way back pulled it up rolled the insulation out did some other stuff and worked my way back up took all my pieces of plywood I had six pieces there remember and then I spread everything out I had a big huge pile right here and I pushed that back make sure you you do that. The last thing you want to do is is leave it all undone. Oh, I'll get I'll take care of it later and later never comes or something. Okay? And I swept I swept this all up. I swept it all up with my broom here. Got up here, made one more one more pass and I I got it all and I'm ready to get out of here. Alrighty.